My name is Chandler Song. I'm one of the co-founders and um, currently CEO of Anchor Network. Uh, I graduated from uh, Uni University of California, Berkeley uh, with a major in electrical engineering and computer science. I'm always very keen to uh, blockchain technology. Other than tech blockchain technology, uh, I'm always you know, interested in uh, artificial intelligence as well as quantitative finance. Um, so uh, currently, you know, other, aside of uh, being a CEO of Anchor Network, I also operate uh, as the product manager of the whole team uh, to you know, put my uh, vision into work. I was introduced to uh, Bitcoin back in 2014, and then you know, later on, uh, I was involved with um, some some of the friends in UC Berkeley, and then you know got introduced to some of the uh, uh, student organization there, uh, including Bitcoin Association, and later on became uh, Blockchain at Berkeley. And then you know uh, I dived a little bit uh, deep uh, into uh, Ethereum in 2017 and then I self-taught uh, myself uh, Solidity programming. Uh, it took me uh, hours and hours, even days, to, uh, to, uh, to download the full nodes. Uh, so it will be a pain uh, for um, you know, most smart contract developers uh, around the world. Anchor is uh, really the first uh, distributed cloud computing solution. Back in the uh, 90s, uh, you know, people started to explore the space uh, using volunteer computing. And then in 2002, uh, the Professor David Anderson created the Boeing project. It really is just a volunteer-based computing platform where there is no uh, economical incentives in a network. Uh, and then aside from that, definitely trying to uh, you know, uh, build a, a more efficient uh, infrastructure with uh, e economic incentive uh, that at the same time provides you know, um, uh, security and confidentiality at the user end. I was working at Amazon last year, you know, exactly one year ago um, uh, in New York City, and then I got to know uh, my super manager, uh, Stanley. Later on, you know, I, I, I kind of pitched this idea to uh, my college roommate, Ryan, uh, and then he got so interested, uh, he even invested his own Bitcoin into me. So he's really my uh, angel investor. Proof of use of work, POUW, is a huge improvement over Bitcoin's uh, proof of work. So uh, rather than wasting the electricity and computing resources towards calculating a hash, uh, we you know, use uh, you know, scientific uh, research to power the entire miners. Uh, so on a high level, you know, Anchor statistically sim simulates uh, the, the Bitcoin's uh, proof of work. Uh, you know, especially the block generation as a you know Bernoulli trial, um, and then uh, later on, uh, you know the uh, enclaves some sort of simulates uh, you know a, uh, the uh, the hash calculation as a uh, Poisson uh, random process. On on the top of the uh, proof of work uh, miners, uh, we have a uh, distributed cloud computing engine. Uh, that's sort of uh, acting as a, um, a job dispatcher or a job scheduler. Uh, so you know, uh, whenever uh, the Bitcoin, uh, sorry, the, the, the blockchain is uh, you know doing their minings, uh, we can always supply jobs uh, to the user end. The Anchor token, you know, it's a utility token within the, uh, the Anchor network platform. Uh, it will be used uh, towards you know, a couple of things. Uh, first of all, it will be used by um, enterprises uh, that want uh, the, their computing tasks to be done. Um, and then they will you know, use the Anchor token to pay the end users, uh, aka the miners. Uh, second of all, uh, you know, it will be used towards the block mining rewards. So different from Bitcoin, so uh, that which only has the block mining rewards, uh, everyone at the same time uh, is doing you know, uh, you know, real work. And, and also, you know, uh, in the future, we will also support uh, you know, transaction fee. And what, uh, so you know, it will be really used in three ways. We've seen in the past uh, Golem project uh, and then um, the, I, the IEX.EC uh, uh, and then we also have um, Sonnen projects 
uh, I think you know uh, one thing that they are all trying to um, leverage is uh, they're trying to use a third party a third party Docker container. You know that uh, really you know sets up a, a sort of like a virtual machine uh, on every platform. Uh, but the anchor is really you know using the computational resources directly from the miners. We're trying to you know, come up with a, a best uh, way to design our public sale. So you know, it really took us a lot of effort to set this up. And then we would be expecting the crowd sale to start you know, uh, early August. So in April, we already have a, a demo. Um, you know, we sort of built our um, prototype running on uh, six, uh, six machines in our office. And then we're constantly improving that. And then, you know, uh, our prototype is basically written in Python. Later on, it will all be translated into C++ for more stability. We're also actively researching on uh, the job dispatcher, job spec scheduler, uh, and then uh, later on this year, we'll um, launch our um, test nets, and then we'll la launch our uh, integration with the existing Boeing project. We also have some you know, exciting business development um, uh, announcement to be made you know, later on this year. We, uh, we are partnering up with some of the uh, larger enterprise companies in the space, uh, as well as in the traditional um, uh, space. So far, we're pretty good with uh, our development in terms of technology and uh, bit, uh, business stuff. But uh, you know, I think you know we, we can uh, actually face some serious problem with uh, you know storage uh, and then with uh, the uh, the surge uh, of you know, mobile users and the GPU. So in in, in the future, in the, in the roadmap. Uh, we're actually uh, considering, you know, building our platform on uh, more, um, you know, GPUs and uh, mobile users, and then in the, in the future, we're also conducting, you know, extensive research, you know, uh, research on decentralized exchange. Uh, exchange. So, uh, how we can uh, power, uh, you know, the uh, de decentralized exchange using uh, trusted execution environment.